guys, and welcome to my channel and to today's video. Uh, oh, it's noisy. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing, demoing the, it's, I think it's Beauty Boulevard, is it? I don't know. I'm crap with like pronouncing stuff. Um, but it's the Glitter Lips uh, in shade Ruby Slippers. Oh my God, I tried this for the first time ever the other day. Like not just this product, but literally like Glitter Lips. Never tried them. I've always seen them. And I think like for me going forward, I'm going to try and get like a clear one. So it's like a clear with a light, like nudie goldy sparkle. I feel like that would be so wearable. Like personally, this was just a bit of fun for me. I don't feel like I would wear this out, but I feel like, you know, with a nice light lit, like goldy one, I would wear that. But literally I was well impressed with this. Like, like I said, I was just doing it for a bit of fun, but actually this turned out so well and it wears really well as well. So like I was just doing this kind of at the end of my day and then I went and ate what did I have I think I had like a curry for dinner it stayed on really well um and the glitter didn't actually transfer off so this is like I don't even know how this works it's really good though so yeah I'll go ahead and put it on I think I paid about 8 99 for this on Sephora, Sephora as well which is really good um they got loads of shades like there's so many shades I would love to try um and it comes with so it did come with like it comes with like a little eyeshadow brush let me see if i've got another one because i did break it um so it comes with like a little mini it's one of those you know like old-fashioned eyeshadow spongy brushes and then on the other end it's like one of these kind of brushes so you can really you know like outline the lips and make it really precise um so it did come with one of those brushes i broke it so it's now in the bin uh also comes with this glue that you pop on and then the glitter so this is like it literally looks like a glitter pot you can get off amazon but it's so fine um it applies really well so yeah basically you go ahead and apply the glitter on the glitter the glue on first well, it seems to have got a bit gloopier than last time and you just want to do one lip at a time so don't do both because they will get stuck together um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and do my bottom lip and i'll probably mute myself so i don't well not mute myself but not talk um just so they don't stick together i mean my first impressions is that this is really strong like it literally smells like i don't know like a really strong eyelash glue i've got a tiny little cut in my lip in the middle and it is stinging it a little bit so just be my my lips sticking together just be mindful i feel like this is quite strong so if you've got cracked lips and stuff i would avoid it just gonna really generously coat this and don't speak when you're doing it like me why the hell has my siri just started talking that just scared the life out of me because i'm alone and then you just want to let that air dry for i don't know 20 seconds or so and then we're going to go straight in and apply the glitter on top so i'm just going to take any old like eyeshadow brush and just dab it on like this oh my god how pretty is this gonna dab it all over like so and don't worry about the fallout because you can just kind of brush that away at the end i will just do it now though but yeah you can wait until the end and this actually takes quite a long time um you might need to like you know apply a bit more glue in little like places at the edges where you don't get to so yeah i'm just gonna shut up now and get on with it And that is the bottom lip done. You will have just seen me removing the, gl the glitter is much easier to remove with like a spoolie rather than a brush, by the way. You might even want to do your foundation afterwards because the glitter does get stuck. Um, so yeah, just bear that in mind. This is my second time using this and it feels actually like it's running out. So I don't know how long these are supposed to last. 
I mean, I know it was relatively cheap, but it definitely feels like it's running out. I'm just going to repeat that again on the top lip. Okay, so the lips are all done. Um, I kind of just need to clean up a tiny bit. But there, there wasn't actually like too much fallout to be honest, like considering how much like with glitter you just get tons of fallout. Um, and it's still kind of drying so I'm going to give it just a couple of minutes to completely dry but literally how stunning is that? Oh my god it's so pretty like I feel like this would look amazing in like a show or something. Oh my god, it's so glittery, like I've never actually seen anything that looks this nice and glittery, like it looks so nice. I don't know how this works to be honest, like how is the glitter not coming away? Because if I kiss my hand, like there's no transfer, the glitter literally does not come off. There's like a tiny little couple of granules or whatever they're called, granules, is that the word? Um, A tiny few, like a few bits have come away, but... It's like, as the glue dries more and more, it's like it kind of... I don't know. I don't know how to explain it because they don't feel like chunky. Like, my lips actually feel quite thin. So it's like, they're not textured or anything. The only place it does feel a little bit weird is like in the inner lip. So where it's getting wet a tiny bit, just inside there, it feels like the glue could start to peel up. At dinner the other day I realised that like that inner bit was peeling upwards where it was getting a bit wet. So I thought oh great I can just literally peel this off but you can't. Um, you do really need to scrub this off. So I noticed that it like this lasted a really long time through eating and drinking like this didn't actually come away. Um, and yeah like I said I thought I'd be able to really easily get it off but I literally had to get like a gritty exfoliator and really scrub it off. Um, so yeah, I don't know, like, could you see there, where that's getting wet, it's like, sticking a little bit. So I think really make sure you coat that glue, like, on the insides with the, um, glitter and then maybe take a cotton bud just to clean it up. Um, but yeah, that's it really. I'm really impressed with this. I feel like for the price and, like, what it's giving... Um, I just think this would look so stunning on like a set or something like that. So nice. I wouldn't particularly personally wear this out on like a night out or anything. But honestly, like I keep checking myself in the mirror. It's so pretty. And like with the light hitting it as well. I hope you can see it on uh, like as well on camera as in real life. It is literally so sparkly and stunning. Um, so yeah, I'm going to give this a 5 out of 5. I love it. Um, no transfer, dries really nicely, really pigmented, super sparkly. Like it's given everything that you could want. Um, the only downside is that part in the middle there when it gets wet starts to peel up a little bit. Um, so just bear that in mind. But yeah, if you've got any questions, just pop them in the comments. Uh, please subscribe to my channel and yeah, I'll see you in my next video.